Stony Creek in Canada, late 19th century. Earl and Janet Lee invited Adelaide to speak. She said women need a voice, a role in society. She said women need a choice. She spoke defiantly. Women are truthful, faithful, wise and resolute. Many inspired by her words formed the Women's Institute. By 1915 the movement had spread across the sea. Much what from British Columbia came to Anglesey. She encouraged farmers' wives to grow food, preserve and store To feed the nations hungry when the men were off at war They supported suffragettes campaigning for the vote Slideshows and talks from their guests equal pay they did promote now William Black's words are heard in countries far and wide With Hubert Parry's melody, they're echoing through time In the hallowed walls of the Albert Hall, before their AGM When the women of the Institute sing Jerusalem When the women of the Institute, St. Jerusalem In the Second World War years, 39 to 45 They helped evacuate the children to the countryside Berkshire 1948, they founded Denman College for women's education, development and knowledge. In 1965, an invite by member the Queen to Buckingham Palace to celebrate their golden jubilee. Now William Black's words are heard in countries far and wide. Hubert Parry's melody, they're echoing through time In the hallowed walls of the Albert Hall, before their AGM When the women of the Institute sing Jerusalem When the women of the Institute sing Jerusalem Alleviating homelessness, recycling waste, highlighting mental health, food banks and climate change. They've moved on from jam and scones, from twin sets and pearls, to the red carpet in Hollywood, Yorkshire's calendar girls, supporting many charities. Busy raising funds Active in the community A woman's work is never done Now William Black's words are heard In countries far and wide With Hubert Parry's melody They're echoing through time In the hallowed vaults of the Albert Hall before their AGM When the women of the Institute Sing Jerusalem When the women of the Institute Sing Jerusalem